relation is pretty lonely, you know, but hey, it is what it is. Boom, let's start. 2021 Atlantic Hurricane Season Animation. These videos are really well animated. So these are tropical storms. Moving to the Caribbean, right there in Mexico, as well as the American East Coast. Mexico had like a little storm going on there. So some damage on New Orleans. 14 fatalities. 350 million. $5,000 worth of damages. That's, that's not bad, all right? That's not that bad. $54 million worth of damages. Hurricane Elsa. Now it's a tropical storm. Kind of crazy. The American coastline keeps getting pummeled by those hurricanes all the time. I know. It's pretty crazy. American hurricanes get insanely crazy. And very costly too. 1.2 billion dollars worth of damages. Jesus Christ. Couldn't imagine this happening over here in Eastern Europe. Yeah. We're gonna watch some some videos of that of that YouTuber. I don't know how to pronounce his name though. So we got Storm, Tropical Storm Fred. Florida is insane, dude. The, the, the amount of storms and hurricanes that Florida has to deal with. I feel really bad for all the... Hurricane Grace. I think I remember this one living in Mexico City. Yeah, I remember this one. This one was bad. Mexico does get some hurricanes, but in Mexico City, we don't get a lot of them. But this one, uh, Hurricane Grace was really bad as you can see 1.3 billion dollars worth of damages and this were all in mexico so it was pretty bad uh same here although i'm not sure if georgia is considered eastern europe uh sometimes yeah georgia is sometimes considered europe although it's complicated you know the border between europe and asia it's kind of hurricane ida or Ida, Ida. Oh, oh, shit. It's a level four. Yo, a fellow Georgian. <laughs> That's so cool, guys. Holy shit. $65 billion, though. If COVID wasn't enough. Also, Louisiana. Louisiana in the U.S. also has to deal with a lot of uh, hurricanes. And it gets really bad when it comes to the damages. Hurricane La Larry, $80 million. Hurricane Nichols. In Yo, Chopo, are you considering any more Geography Now reactions in the future? We'd love to see my country featured here. We can do it today, man. If you have a, a little bit of time, we can do it. We can do it actually after this video. What do you think about that? Tropical Storm, no, Hurricane Sam and Tropical Storm Teresa. 
Damn, I thought I thought 2021 would be pretty quiet, but damn, we got a few really bad hurricanes. We got now Sam getting close to the Caribbean, but it's it seems like it's not gonna reach the North American continent. At least the landmass of the North American continent. We got bad flooding in the UK and parts of Western Europe. Damn. I've heard there's a lot of rain in the UK and a lot of like clouds and rain and it gets really windy there. Apparently that's what I've heard. I've never been to the UK. I would love to go there. Tropical Storm Wanda. A bit unexpected there. <laughs> Lol, I would appreciate it. Yeah, sure. Let's do it, man. Wanda 200 million worth of damages. Yeah, I mean, you just gotta feel really bad for Louisiana. There's a lot of people from Louisiana and Houston. So yeah, we only had one purple one, Hurricane Ida. And it's like 150 miles per hour. That's insane. By the way, Chopo, do you play live Blackjack or Smith? LOL, I saw a guy with your little nickname while working. Really? No, I actually don't. Someone is uh, copywriting my nickname. No, it's okay. I don't really do a lot of gaming, to be honest. Hurricane Sam was also pretty bad. It was like reserved to the ocean. And if you can see, like, it's all Florida, it's all uh, Louisiana, it's all, like, east, eastern U.S. It rained all Christmas in 2021, then on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, we had blue sky and sunshine. That's pretty cool. Pretty convenient, I would say. Um, but, yeah, I, I like the cold weather. I like it when it's raining, you know? It makes me feel happy. 